Hello. In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to download and install a device driver using the driverguide.com website. I'm going to be searching for this particular driver using the make and model of the device, and I'll be doing this on a Windows 7 system. Now, the way I'm going to find the make and model of my device is going to be using my device manager, which is part of my operating system. In this example, I'm going to actually uh, be looking for a driver for a touchpad pointing device which is built into my laptop. Now there are several ways of getting to the device manager. Uh, the way I'm going to get there is simply by clicking on the start button. I can then right click on computer and choose manage. From there my computer management window opens and I can see device manager right there. I'm going to click on it and I'm looking for my pointing devices. So I'm going to expand this mice and other pointing devices option. And I see my Dell touchpad device is right there. So using that uh, particular description, Dell touchpad, as my make and model, I'm going to go over to the driverguide.com website. Right there on the home page, I'm going to click in the search box, type in Dell touchpad and click search. And in just a couple of seconds I will have uh, several result, results to choose from. I'm going to search through these results here and look for my particular uh, system, the download that matches my system. And here I'm going to I'm going to go ahead and choose this one right here for the latitude. And I'm going to click on this file name which brings me to the download page. And right here again is the file name that I'm going to click on to directly download that file to my machine. I'm going to go ahead and save it and wait for it to download. Once the file has downloaded, I can simply go to the location where I saved the file. And there is my executable. Simply double click the file, accept the prompts, say install. Again, accept the prompts, go through the wizard, and it should take just a couple of seconds to install. And here I see a screen that says my driver was successfully installed. Click finish, and now it wants to reboot my computer. And that is how you use the driverguide.com website to search for, download, and install a driver using the make and model of your device.